everyone, it's me Nikki here with a quick meeting tip on how to set up a morning meeting food setup. And I posted on my Instagram and Facebook this week that I was having some people over to work on a project and we were working mainly out of this room here which is my woman cave, my craft room. If you haven't seen this uh, space on this channel, I may not have ever shown this but this is where I edit my videos, I record a lot of my videos, I do a lot of my crafts, I do a lot of my DIYs and this is kind of my space here that I work out of and, and relax in and do just everything and this is just my, my space. And so um, because we were meeting up here, I wanted to have a table set up um, so that we had some light eats while we worked. The thing about it is I was a manager for years in a company and I always had to plan team meetings and things like that. And I always believed in having a nice morning set up for my team. I think you can do it very simple and easy. Uh, that's what I want to do with this video is share you some tips on what worked for me over the years and how I did it. Um, because it's nothing fancy, but it's something that I put a little effort into because I want people to know that I care more about you than you running to Dunkin' Donuts and throwing the box on the table to have a meeting. So you just with a little more effort, you can give just a little more to your team. Okay, so I mentioned the Dunkin' Donuts box, throwing it on the table. I am so not against the donuts in the box or buying pastries from the grocery store. That is what I do. Keep it simple. You have a lot going on. You can't really just um, do a lot of baking. You, you just need to buy it, but it's in your presentation. Now, the thing about it is always incorporate biscotti into your table. This is great for those who really don't want to have a big muffin or don't want to eat a lot in the morning, and they can just simply have a biscotti with their coffee, and then it gives a little kind of upgrade to your table, just having that simple thing. And you can get a box of it in the grocery store really simple now simple drink varieties you know you want to keep I typically like to have three different varieties one is water one is a juice and one is coffee you know I have sparkling water here I put it in the ice bucket again a simple act that just really upscales gives it a better look than just throwing the water on the table you know the same with my coffee cups I put out real coffee cups I put out um, goblets so that they can pour their orange juice in it with the straws that coordinate with the color theme of the table I mean this stuff takes really no effort to do but when your team comes in it just looks like you really spent a lot of time and effort putting it together. Now, the other thing is fruit. Always incorporate fruit into your breakfast meeting table because it just really is a great, act. you know, everyone loves fruit. You know, a lot of people, most people do. And so I did the fruit arrangement here, which takes about an hour to do. But if you don't want to do something like this, definitely get fresh flowers to put in the center of your table and then just put fruit in a bowl or put fruit in a bowl that's kind of higher than the pastries and then use that as your centerpiece. You don't necessarily have to do the arrangement fruit is beautiful in itself just put it in a beautiful bowl now it is all about the details which don't take much time putting these straws in a glass you can get these straws all day long and target off Amazon I'll put some link in the description box below also make sure it coordinates with your little saucers here you can even use um, white plates here but I decided to go with the kind of robin's egg blue type of theme and also I coordinated that with um, the water that I was serving and you know it had that blue in it so everything kind of kept a uniform look you want to keep it bright simple it's morning time you don't want to overwhelm anyone but you know I just wanted something to look special I wanted it to feel special but I didn't have to put a lot of effort into it the only thing that I put the effort into it was the one hour and putting the fruit display in there and that was a great impact on the table again you can even do these the night before and then just stick them into your um, styrofoam that morning to save you time you know simply you can go to the dollar store get these silver trays if you don't want to have to bring out um, white plates and things like that if you're working like out of the office and things like that this is so easy to stack and carry in put it on the table put your pastries on it put your fruit on it um, put it on the table even by simply doing that it makes a better impact than just putting a box of donuts on the table so I hope you've um, enjoyed just my quick little tips of sharing kind of my thought process I, I always get asked of Nikki uh, what is your thought process when you're putting things together and doing things and so this is kind of how I think and and you know when I'm putting together something for a meeting and I wanted to pass it along to share with you if you have any questions Questions, definitely let me know. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll be coming to you with more. Take care and I'll see you at the next one. And this is Nikki saying goodbye.